Hello, my name is Quinn. You're watching Vietnam Today. Let's check out the headline for this hour. Vietnam Chinese province to tighten economic trade links. Vietnam remains the world's second largest smartphone exporter. Biển Biên basking in Bohemia blooming season. With their market size and complementary strength, Vietnam and Shandong province of China still have a lot of room to enhance economics and trade cooperation. An official of the Vietnamese Ministry of Industry and Trade said on March 13. Addressing a business marching conference in Hanoi, the Vietnamese MRIT attaches great importance to Shandong, a leading province in economic development in China. Last year, Shandong posed 10.9 billion US dollar in trade turnover with Vietnam. The MRIT is ready to coordinate it with authorities of China and Shandong to help businesses carry out cooperation activity. A representative of the Shandong Provincial People Government said as Vietnam and China are important economic and trading partners and their industrial are complementary. Cooperation potential is considerable. Promoting economic and trade cooperation is crucial for intensifying the comprehensive strategic cooperative partnership. Vietnam has remained the world's second largest smartphone exporter. By 2022, Vietnam export share reached 12% on the global smartphone market, while India, a rival of Vietnam in this market, ranks seventh with a little over 2.5% export share. The Hindu.com cited the General Department of Customs as saying Vietnam's export value of all types of phones and components in January reached more than 5.5 billion US dollar, an increase of more than 50.4 percent compared to December 2023. The US and China became the largest customer of Vietnamese phones and components. The General Department of Customs statistics also show that in 2010, the the export turnover of phone components and components only account for 3.2% of the total national export value. Still, this group of electronic products gain an annual average growth rate of 34% in export value from 2011 to 2021. Hanoi to build a digital map system for smart tourism. Google Arts and Culture introduced Vietnam Hardboard Art Journal. The Hanoi Department of Tourism will build a digital map system for smart tourism in the city, develop and expand the tourism sector data management scheme, update the agriculture tourism database, and increase the use of information technology in promoting the capital image to domestic and international tourists. The Hanoi Department of Tourism has gradually improved the Internet of Things infrastructure to serve smart tourism applications, continue to implement tourism database software, accelerated the progress of data digitization synchronized with Hanoi's tourism information system and databases digitized the results of administrative procedures and upgraded the department's website to ensure convenient access for tourists and locals. In addition, the department has set up a hotline for free information support and solution consulting services 24 hours a day to receive and process feedback and recommendations from tourists properly. Google Arts and Culture recently released an article introducing Vietnamese hardboy, a type of classical opera. This is part of the alternative identities, Mass of the ASEAN and Korea exhibition to introduce the cultural heritage of humanity. In 
Google Arts and Cultures description, Hat Boy or Tuong is a traditional Vietnamese classical drama that encourages Vietnamese people to consider their past and present life. This type of mass drama combines music and dance while featuring distinctive makeup and customs. The website noted that Hot Boy dramatized Vietnamese folk tales or fables, while it can also be based on various scripts created in historical, political, social, and cultural settings. Google Arts and Culture is an online platform developed by Google to showcase the rich heritage of diverse cultures, art and art movements, and various civilizations worldwide. Band flowers are in full bloom along the streets in Dien Bien Phu city, covering all the passes and mountains of in Dien Bien province. At the Band Flower Festival during National Tourism Year 2024, visitors can take selfies with the beautiful flowers. Located in the northwest region, Điện Biên province is not only famous for the historic Điện Biên Phu victory, but it is also known for the land of Bohemia flowers. March is the blooming season of the flower. Bohemia flowers symbolize purity and fidelity and love. They are the iconic flower of Dien Bien and Vietnam's northwestern region. The Ban Flower Festival began on Wednesday in Dien Bien Phu City, which also opens National Tourism Year in Dien Bien Phu, with the team returned to the Bohemia region. I was born here in Dien Bien. The Bohemia flower is familiar to me. However, this beauty of a pure white with a little pink remains so different and unique to me. I love taking pictures with Bohemia flowers. Every March, the white color of the flower covers all mountains. It's like the pure beauty of a Dien Bien girl. Bohemia flower blossom along the roads and at all the historical relic signs such as Hill D1, Hill A1, and Hill E. Ban Flower Festival attracts many visitors every spring. The Ban Flower Festival has been held annually since 2014 and has become a tourism brand of Dien Bien Province. That's the end for today. Thanks for your watching and see you next time.